Hello, I'm your Daily Tech, and this is a quick tutorial on how to install the Gear VR version of RiftCat on your Samsung phone. Using this version will allow you to take advantage of the built-in sensors and other added benefits that the Gear VR offers. Since siloed VR is no longer available, we will need to use Construct VR for the install. Construct VR is an app sharing platform for non-official Gear VR apps. Because of this, it will require a couple extra steps for the install. For starters, you'll need to click the invite link in the description below for RiftCat to share the app with you. This will bring you to the RiftCat sharing page on Construct VR. This step can be done on your PC or directly on your phone. From here, you'll need to type in a valid email so they can email you a link. This will email you another link to the Construct VR download in the Google Play Store. Download this and run it. Once it opens, you'll need to create an account. Once the account has been created, you can log into that account with your new username and password. Once logged in, you'll now be able to see the RiftCat software. Click on Accept Invite, then Download. You'll see it verify your account, then build the APK and download the app. You will now be faced with this warning saying your install is blocked. So tap Settings, then you'll need to go down to the Install from Unknown Sources and tap that. Now it will give you a warning about doing this, but just click on OK and it will allow it to install this one time. Now you can tap the Final Install button and let it finish. Once complete, click on Done, then we can head back to our home screen. From here, I would suggest to open up your apps folder and find the newly installed VRidge for Gear VR icon. Drag that onto your home screen and open it up. It will now tell you to insert your phone into the Gear VR and RiftCat will automatically start up from there. Once it's in your Gear VR, check the on-screen prompts and you'll be able to connect your phone to RiftCat as you normally would now, and then begin playing Steam VR games on your Gear VR. Hopefully this guide helped you out, so please remember to like the video and subscribe for more DIY VR content in the future. Also, don't forget to check my channel for more great content using RiftCat. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.